Greetings, everyone. My name is Ray. I'm a PhD student at MIT CSAIL. I work with Professor Paulina Golan at MIT and Dr. Stephen Horn and Dr. Seth Berkowitz from Beth Israel Dickens Medical Center. We developed novel machine learning algorithms to non-invasively assess pulmonary edema in order to help physicians better manage heart failure patients. Dr. Stephen Horn is an emergency room physician. Two years ago, Dr. Horn reached out to our lab at MIT and told us how difficult and frustrating it is to manage heart failure. 20% of heart failure patients get readmitted within 30 days of discharge. Dr. Horn is not alone. As a leading cause of hospitalization, every year there are 1 million heart failure hospital stays in the U.S. and the healthcare system spends $12 billion on heart failure hospitalization. Most of the heart failure emergency visits and hospitalizations are due to patients' shortness of breath, caused by their fluid overload in the lungs, aka pulmonary edema. When the heart cannot pump out blood effectively, the blood pressure backs up in the right ventricle all the way to the lungs. Due to the increased pressure, the blood and the fluid leak into the lung space, causing pulmonary edema. In clinical practice, chest X-ray is commonly performed to assess pulmonary edema and is a routine examination in the emergency room to make differential diagnosis. However, the reading and interpretation of chest X-ray images suffer from high interreader disagreement among radiologists. This inconsistency leads to poor discharge and disposition decision-making. Many heart failure patients are discharged from hospital while they still have fluid overload. Those patients eventually exacerbate again and get readmitted to the emergency room. This clinical challenge, on the other hand, creates an opportunity for machine learning and AI to pick up those subtle yet important pathological findings from chest X-ray images that might have been missed by clinicians. To develop such a robust machine learning model, we have worked with Beth Israel Dickness Medical Center and have collected about 370,000 chest X-ray images and their associated radiology reports written by many radiologists. The radiology reports have documented the radiologist's interpretation of those images. We have constructed an AI model that is trained from the images as well as the reports to learn the assessment of pulmonary edema. This approach enables our computer vision model to essentially acquire the capabilities of many human experts. When a new chest X-ray image comes in, our AI model takes advantage of the aggregated capability of chest X-ray interpretation and instantly makes accurate assessment of patient fluid status. Our experimental results that are recently published in a top clinical journal demonstrate that our AI model is comparable to the performance of four radiologists' consensus assessment and outperforms the independent assessment of each individual radiologist. Our recent retrospective analysis also shows that the, the fluid overload that our computer vision model is able to detect correlates with patients' likelihood of getting readmitted based on the clinical data collected at Beth Israel over 10 years. We are very excited about the potential of our technology and also the future of computational intelligence in medicine. The instant and accurate radiographic image interpretation that our AI model offers can improve hospital efficiency. By picking up missing pathological findings, our algorithms help physicians stage early interventions and make better discharge decisions to reduce avoidable readmissions and emergency room visits. With the healthcare system shifting to value-based care, this technology lowers the cost for both providers and medical insurers, and eventually improves clinical outcomes of heart failure patients. Sparked at MIT, incubated in the DISH-Bundy program, we are looking to make an impact in medicine. 
we are currently working with three clinical centers to generalize our AI model and pilot our AI system, including Beth Isro Dickness Medical Center, Tuft Center, and University of Colorado Hospital. Also, Mayo Clinic, Heidemann Healthcare, and Veterans Affairs Hospitals in Texas have agreed to partner with us, our toolkits to build this initial AI solution, and our channels to hospital information systems can be modularized and readily scaled to other clinical domains. With the rapid digitalization of healthcare data over the past decade, hospitals have accumulated a large amount of clinical data that has yet to be utilized. Retrospective medical data contains invaluable insights for future clinical management. We will ultimately make it faster and easier to discover those patterns and to build computing solutions upon them. We are at the early stage of this journey. If you are excited about this future as we are, please come to our booth and share your thoughts. Thank you.